a little bit of family history, a little bit of firearms history coming right up. Dun, da -da -dun, dun, da -da -dun, dun. Hey guys, it's a late Boy Scout, and today um, I've got a little, a little bit of something I need your help with. I want to try to identify a little firearms artifact. I'm going to show that to you in just a second. I'm also going to tell you some history behind it because I think it's pretty interesting. Right now, I am at my parents' old house. They are cleaning this place out, and uh, they've already moved out of it, but there's a ton of accumulated stuff. I come from a pretty big family. So there's a ton of old accumulated stuff here, some of their stuff, some of our stuff, that I'm helping to sort through and clean out and get rid of and pack up and give away and throw away. <laughs> anyway, a lot of work to do here. But in doing some of that work today, I came across something pretty interesting with a pretty interesting story. Let's show it to you now. You ever seen one of these? This is a 25 ACP magazine. I don't know what it goes to, but I recognize the caliber. Holds seven rounds. Give you a look at the magazine. You can see that it looks like it's spot welded down there at the bottom. The bluing is obviously starting to rust a bit. I have no idea what handgun this goes to. I know there are a handful of uh, 25 ACP really small handguns out there that something this small uh, would go to, but I have no idea what it is. So I want your help in identifying it. Now for the story of this magazine. Now this is a pretty interesting story. All right, so what happened was um, I was helping to clean, helping my mom clean some stuff out, some boxes, and uh, came across a box filled with a handful of things. And in that box, found this little magazine. Now, of course, obviously, I was drawn to it right away and thought, whoa, where'd that come from? I didn't know my parents had a gun somewhere. Where's the gun that this goes to? Because my parents, uh, I've never explained this to you guys, really, but I didn't really come from a shooting family. My dad, I think, had a, maybe a hunting rifle or I have no idea what type it was, and a small handgun long, long ago. Uh, and I think my mom had told me a long time ago that she actually had her own little handgun for, I guess, self-defense, but she got rid of it. And uh, this is kind of the interesting part. Um, and I scolded her a little bit for this. She's my mom, but still. Uh, apparently, the, what happened to that handgun was she, uh, she took that handgun and, hey, how's it going? Just shooting a little video over here, so don't mind me. Uh, that's my brother-in-law and his daughter. Anyway, um, so as we were um, looking over this handgun, uh, looking over this magazine, my mom told me, "Well, yeah, I, uh, I used to have a handgun that that went to, and I was so scared of it that I actually kept them separate. So the handgun was in one place, and the magazine was somewhere else. I kept it unloaded, but I was so scared and unable to use it, and had no idea how to manage it properly or what to do with it. I was just scared that it was going to." come into my room and shoot me or one of you kids someday. <laughs> I mean, this is literally like my mom was that scared of guns, okay? Um, but because she was so frightened of it, she took that 25 ACP handgun and threw it in the trash. Literally just threw the gun in the trash. Didn't dispose of it by selling it to somebody. Didn't uh, take it to a dump or have it smashed or destroyed in some other way. She literally threw it in the trash. <laughs> so I have no idea what gun it was. I hope it didn't end up in the wrong hands somehow at the dump or something, but uh, I, I suppose it probably just went into a landfill. But the magazine, she didn't know where the magazine was at the time when she was throwing the gun away, so it still exists. So, taking a look, you guys could help me identify it. Let me know what gun this might have gone to. That would be really interesting for me to know and to have that little tidbit of family history restored. I'm a late Boy Scout. Thanks for watching this. Thursday vlog. We'll see you later.